Are you stuck on trying to find a topic for your dental blog post? Hi, I'm Dr. Jared Johnson. Today's tip is on blogging for your dental website. It may sound daunting or challenging, but really it's pretty easy. The first way to come up with a blog post is just take the question that your patients are asking you and write a blog about it. So why are my kids teeth yellow? How many baby teeth are going to come in? What causes canker source? These are all easy things that you can go ahead and take and turn into a blog post. The second way to do it is to go ahead and use a tool like I use, answerthepublic.com and type in a keyword. So maybe it is white crowns. I offer sprig crowns at my office. And if you want to write a blog post on that to try to capture someone, maybe you type in that. It's going to give you the who, what, where, when, and why of the keywords. It's essentially what people are typing into Google. And that can give you a great slug and a topic for your blog post. So maybe it's someone Googling, why aren't crowns for kids white crowns? That would be a good one. And you can go ahead and create a blog post on that. And if someone Googles that in your local area, you're going to capture that lead. They're going to find out you offer the service and they're going to be more likely to book with you. And this is so much more cost effective than Googling uh, someone, someone Googles dentist near me. Like it's specific to a service or complaint or question that they have. And it's a marathon to do this, but the more you do it, the better off you're going to do, it's going to increase your SEO and you're going to rank higher in Google in the long term if you're answering the higher up in the funnel rather than Dennis Neary.